Three men jailed in Broward County tonight after police say they kidnapped someone and threatened that person. Detectives say that those three men kidnapped the wrong person. NBC 6's Nico Clemens is live tonight with the story. Nico. Uh, Juan Trina, imagine how terrifying, how shocking this was for this victim. Uh, police say they got the wrong guy, they kidnapped the wrong guy, but instead of letting him go, they tortured him. And detectives say the person they were searching for was his coworker. A man kidnapped while leaving his Fort Lauderdale apartment last Friday. Detectives say the man was walking to his car inside the garage at Society Las Olas Apartments on Southwest First Avenue when one of the kidnappers walked up to him holding a gun, wearing a mask and a police outfit, and forced him into a car with another kidnapper. Police say they drove the victim to a rental property and plantation and realized they abducted the wrong person. But instead of releasing him, police say the kidnappers threatened to kill the victim while pointing guns and other weapons at him. The criminal complaint says at one point the kidnappers covered the victim's face and poured buckets of water on him. The complaint says the victim thought he was going to drown. So detectives say the kidnappers learned that the person they were searching for was at a Pompano Beach strip club. So they brought the victim here. The offender admitted to taking part in the kidnapping. Police say the kidnappers tried to get the victim to lure his coworker out the business. But once he went inside the club, he called 911. And they're brothers. Deputies arrested Jeffrey Arista and his brother, Jonathan Arista. Raymond Gomez was also charged in the crime. While in court, one of the attorneys for one of the brothers seemed to joke about the kidnapping. I got to tell you, Judge, in the history of kidnappings, this would be the first time someone gets kidnapped and taken to a strip club. I got to tell you, I've never heard of that before. Outside Society Las Olas. People who live at the apartment are stunned. I'm surprised that nobody saw this going on, so it sounds like they need to tighten up security more. If people could get kidnapped, it's, I could easily get robbed. So the criminal complaint says the victim's co-worker allegedly owed the kidnappers money. The two brothers, they were in court. That's what you saw uh, just a few seconds ago. Uh, Gomez, he has not gone before a judge yet, but all three, they still remain in jail. In Miami, Nico Clemens, NBC 6 News. All right, Nico.